Ready. All right, so here we go with this stand-up only encounter. We'll see if these guys can play by the rules. Not many rules, but you can't grapple at all. No wrestling of any kind. You also are not permitted to do follow-up strikes on the floor. We are underway. That's going over the top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low, and then come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts. Very bad. Nice defense there. Huge block. Trying to kick the leg out. Man, this is fun to watch if you like striking as these fighters go back and forth. side, but at this point, you just got to find that kill shot and get him out of there. A lot of times that comes with reps, that comes with taking your time. You get excited, and you want to finish it because you think it's right there, but at times you just overswing and you miss a lot. Hold it up. Hold it up. Job getting those hands up. Hands up. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Good jab. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, it's stringing them together so effectively, never doing the same attack more than once. What a job! to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. Oh, there's that kick, and it lands. Lee's cut above the eye now from that strike, so we'll see how the fighter deals with that deficit adversity now. They continue to exchange. Massive body kick lands. have now landed for the former champion, Chris Weidman. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg from DC. It is a great technique, but it only takes one time to check it, right? And your night can be over, or you can end up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue? Here's a tissue. <laughs> Round two straight ahead. All right, heading back to the corner now, and... We will keep a close eye on things. Lee's bleeding from the forehead there a little bit. It doesn't appear to be too bad. The focus for the cut man, though, to make sure that he can stop the bleeding and not allow the blood to get into the eyes. All right, so there's the end of the round. And on one side, thrill on the other, agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how technical he is. It allows him to land in spots where his opponent is winging punches. Great strike landed, great punch landed to put his opponent down. Ready, ready, Go. Second round here. Great job landing that body kick. that left hand. High volume on both sides, and both of these guys oh, huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. body movement defensively slips another strike there and offensively he hasn't been a world beater but defensively he's been strong tonight and that has to cause frustration for the opponent not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away but that's a testament to the head and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. high level mma 
MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by the All-American watch. Huge block there. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Lee's eye is closing up. Fighter lands a kick to the leg now and a pretty good one at that. And both guys really throwing with authority. Two minutes to go. Let's go. Keep the reach advantage was his at the outset, and he was able to take advantage there with the punch. Work that work. Straight. Good body work with that hook by what? All right, so a knockdown for him in the previous round. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to take down that finish. Seconds to go in the round. Uh, round three next. Stop, stop, stop. The rest is looking great. We got five more minutes to victory. You can get in there and be all over it. You can do anything for five minutes. Let's put the pace on this. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. Third and final round here. All right, next round is now on the continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Oh, that's a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to the Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body start to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Sidekick now. Offense is on the menu tonight. Back and forth we go. Nice block. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there. Really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game. And if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the way. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent. Oh, oh my God, it's hurt. It's hurt. Swing and a miss with that punch by Lee. Hands high, hands high. Throws that deep and it lands. He gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Well, I am not going out on a limb when I say he is on the wrong side of this fight. Maybe a little bit rattled after getting knocked down earlier in the round. But that's exactly what you expect, right? He took such a bad knockdown early. It's going to be on him to build back into this fight as we go forward. Weidman's nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Oh. 
Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both guys have been beat up. Both guys have done a great job of landing, recognizing what they wanted to get done, and it shows. This is a very evenly matched fight. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. All right, the official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 30-27 for the winner by unanimous decision, the R.